Look how cute they are, riding a little baby toy. <laughs> I think they're about to break it. That poor spring. <laughs> well, Amy's cake table is uh, as you would expect it on a cake weekend. Oh my gosh, it's a mess. It's horrible. Now she's got to clean off a spot so she can actually take a picture of this amazing cake she did. So um, there's a little giraffe she made, a little baby giraffe, and a little baby lion, and baby elephant. I think it turned out really nice. She did. She even did that to the cake board, put like a ribbon around the box, like it's a double cake board. Looks very nice, babe. Thank you. I like the backdrop here. I think this right here should be the photo. Oh my gosh. Like right here guys, look, look, I'm gonna freeze it and this is her photo to put on her page. Bam, right there guys. Th this little bag over here, right there, with the scraps and stuff, perfect. Oh yeah, can't forget the smash cake. And there's the little smash cake she did. It's all buttercream icing, no fondant. Match the uh, base of the cake. Very cute. So Amy's got me running late guys. I'm blaming it all on her, what? as usual. I wanted, to be, I, I wanted to be there at 12.30 to have everything out there ready to go. And it's only 12.45. No, well, I'm at 12.30 and she's supposed to read my mind. That's part of being married to me. It's 12.32 and practice is five minutes away and it starts at one o'clock. She busy. decided to sit and blab on her phone for 30 minutes before it was time to leave. And now she's also going to leave me for the weekend. Like she's leaving after dinner tonight and she's going to go to Dallas and just leave me. Oh yeah, yeah. I am. I'll be gone for two days. Yeah, so that means I have to work from home on Monday. Hopefully my boss doesn't want to fire me because I'm working from home now. Just blame it on Julie. I'm just blaming on Amy as usual. Practice has begun. They're doing Eric's favorite drill. Follow the ball. Jacob's up. I see a monkey in the tree. Are you a monkey? <laughs> How are you gonna get down? Jump. Okay, don't get hurt. That's the goal, right? I got it. Did you? Yeah. <laughs> I'll give you a little tree. There's a monkey in that tree too. He's even higher up. His mom is gonna kill me. <laughs> Look how cute they are, riding a little baby toy. I think they're about to break it. That poor spring. Playing knockout. Take him in it's round two. Has to be fair. Good job, buddy. How did first practice go, coach? It went very well. Um, I was happy. <laughs> Uh, overall, I, I would say that there's some there's some work that needs to be done for sure because kids haven't some of the kids haven't they didn't play fall ball or whatever so they're just now getting back throwing a baseball and catching a baseball. Even if they play fall but haven't played since. But then. overall, 
It was, it was I, I was impressed. Uh, and then at the end, I went ahead and played one of the games where we do the hitting game. You got to hit it out. Basically, knockout for baseball. And I was very impressed with the kids hitting. They, they, they hit the ball very well. I was very happy, very pleased. <laughs> just hope it carries over and just keeps going with it. But they look really good. Jacob was crushing that ball. Yeah, he was. I was very happy. So we're about to head to dinner with two of the assistant coaches. And so with all three families combined and with Cooper with us, there's going to be 15 people. <laughs> it's going to be hard to find a place that seats 15 people. But that's why we're going early. Like it's 3 o'clock now. They said we're going to meet up there around 4 before the big dinner crowd comes. My husband is the worst about putting things where they belong, whether it be tools, or hats or anything so his deodorants that he's been wearing the last few days he just puts it randomly in places whenever he like he starts walking puts it on wherever he stops is where it goes don't listen to her guys i, I put it, it was, where it seems like it belongs okay so the other day it was on top of your dresser <laughs> and then on top of our closet uh -huh. and then on the mantle and then now it's up there well i'm like at least i'm like putting it in places where it like kind of it, it adds to it see you know, no. I'm just saying, see, moms get stressed out sometimes. She might need deodorant. There's the deodorant there. Yeah, because deodorant helps stress, totally. No, but you sweat when you're stressed and everything. Okay, so, and so I the moral of the story is... I put things where they probably shouldn't go a lot. And I, I, was, I changed my clothes after practice, put on a different shirt, put on fresh in my deodorant, set it over there. Because that's where it goes. Because I told her I'm going to start moving it around in different random places. It's like the elf on the shelf, but it's the deodorant on the shelf, right? And... So I went and I was like, I need a different hat. My Astros hat doesn't go with this. So I went top of the closet, grabbed the hat out. And I was like, oh, wow, there's something. And it was like, what? There was $6 in my hat. It was just. Because that's where that goes it was too. Just randomly in here, there was six bucks in my hat. <laughs> I'm going to go look through the rest of my hats in there and see what else I can buy. That's mine, by the way. No. Uh -huh. I randomly put it it's there. My hat. <laughs> my hat. My treasure. Yeah, I would not put money there. No, I know, exactly. So I just finished packing my bags and it is 7.15 and I'm about to walk out the door to drive to Dallas. Yes, I'm driving to Dallas tonight. I'm meeting my aunt there. We got some things we have to take care of. We got Mr. Mom here who hopefully will survive without me for two days. It's Saturday night now and I'll be back Monday night. Can you do this? It's gonna be hard, honey. You know, Xander's on like five different medications, right? I'm gonna go find a wife real quick. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm just kidding. I got the best one. <laughs> You're so funny. I know, looking. <laughs> you well, got this. It's two days. I can do this. You know what? I was irritated earlier because we were, we went out to dinner and I was like, is Amy ever gonna pull the camera out so we can get some footage? Yeah, because we weren't sitting together. Like the guys were sitting together and then the girls were sitting together and we had like two people in. And. I'm sitting there and I'm just thinking, man, is she ever gonna pull the camera out? At least get a little panorama of like everybody here because it was 15 people. All there was a ton of kids at the table. Nine kids. And then there was the night we were at the waterway, so it was all pretty waters and lights and all this awesome stuff going on. And we get home and I'm asking her where the camera's at, and she's like, I don't have the camera. And I go, Oh, there it is. <laughs> So you guys stayed in my pocket the whole time and never got to see the, the awesome footage that could have been had. The nine kids yeah, at our was, table. Was a lot of kids. More and, kids and, than adults. And it was like, it ranged in age. And how many girls versus boys were there? One girl. One girl and eight boys. We still have Cooper. Yeah, you're about to take him then. I am. She's about taking to drop him, him off. No. She's going to drop him off in Dallas. I am not. Yeah, you know, she's taking him over back to his house. No, actually, to his grandma's, grandma's house, house because their house is like empty now. It's sad. It is. Like, right? I think this I'm is the last time I see Cooper, guys. Cooper, get in here. <laughs> He's Cooper. in the middle of the game. Cooper. <laughs> Cooper, come here. Come you in the vlog one last time. Come here. It's not going to be the last time. It's the last time for a while, at least. Hey, pause that game. He's pause like, it, guys. He's like, I don't want to. He's not going to come over here because they were not pausing. They're trying to kill him. Next time you see him, he's going to be like this tall. He better not be. He better not be. He's going to be a famous have... hockey player now. He said he's going to go to Colorado and he's going to play hockey. He right? better not have a mustache. <laughs> he's going to have a big beard and mustache. His voice is going to be like, hey, how you guys do? <laughs> right? But he's still going to scream like a girl. I mean, we have that clip of him screaming like Yesterday, a girl. Yesterday, yes. Yeah. <laughs> We've known Cooper since... Since he was three. Yes. Yeah. And that was year seven years ago. That was a long time ago. That's crazy. But we'll still see him. We're going to visit Colorado. Just not as often as... So yeah, I'm, I'm sad, guys. Cooper's leaving. Amy's leaving. And I'm stuck here to have to fend for myself and, and, and 
and drug my child up. I don't, I don't know that I can do this. Yes, you can. You well, got this, babe. Hey, you know what we're gonna do tomorrow, though? Because Amy's not gonna be here. We're gonna go to the grocery store. We're gonna buy a bunch of soda, and we're gonna do the soda challenge. Mm -hmm. It's fine. So I don't have to clean it we're up. We're gonna have a soda challenge. <laughs> the front what, front driveway is gonna be so sticky. There's gonna be ants Lot, all over oh, it when Amy yeah, comes back. No, because <laughs> you better spray that thing down. <laughs> but we're doing the soda challenge, so be prepared for that. It's gonna be fun. We might do something else, so I don't know what, but that should take up a pretty good bit of the video, I think. All right, guys, smile for the camera. Take a picture right quick. <laughs> smile. He's in a video. Just smile, guys. <laughs> Just, wait, what are you doing? This is the picture. Come on. Come on. Oh. You, already, you already done? That was yeah. that fat? Dude, we just got here. I was going to see what candy you guys wanted to get. Decision time, man. What is it? What's it going to be? No. My choice. Your choice. What is it? There is. You, you don't want to candy make a set? You, you, you don't want to change your decision? There's candy corn right there. To nerds and Mike and Ike's, huh? And Reese's Pieces and Sour Patch. All right, let me see what I want. What are we watching? Uh, Goosebumps. Goosebumps. You guys excited? Yeah, it's starting. It is getting started, and we are watching it now. We'll let you guys know what we thought about it after the movie's over. We'll give you a little quick review before the boys go to bed, and then the boys are going to dance their booties off. <laughs> no, they're not. I'm just kidding around, but they will be going to bed. Let me go ahead and tell you. Spoiler alert right now, okay? If you don't want to hear anything about Goosebumps, Skip ahead in the video until you see the next clip, okay? Just look at the little preview bar down there and skip ahead to a scene that doesn't look like they're laying in the bed here, okay? All right, what was y'all's favorite part of Goosebumps? Um, whenever, the, whenever the his um, aunt or whoever she was um, ran over the wolf man and said, I think I ran over the bear. Um, I think bear. I killed the bear. <laughs> what about you, dude? Uh, I liked all of it. Oh, uh, really well, what was part. your favorite part? Okay, what was the scariest part? It wasn't. Uh, what was the creepiest part? How about that? That sounds better. What was the creepiest part? Like, I part? didn't know what was coming, and it was like a bunch of zombies. On, like, oh, the creepy. zombies were creepy? So, what I thought was the creepiest part was there was a clown. Clowns are creepy. Oh, yeah, never mind. The, the clown was creepy, clown. and so was the little ventriloquist doll. He was creepy, too. The dummy? The, you, what are you calling me? I'm not. He's a dummy. Who? The dummy. <laughs> oh, the dummy was a dummy, huh? All right, well, it is bedtime, guys. Tomorrow we shall do the soda challenge. It's going to be lots of fun. We're doing it tomorrow. Hey, you did really good at practice today, dude. I'm proud of you. Very proud of you. All right, tell them all, tell them all good night. You're not going to see them anymore tonight. Tell them good night. Good night. Neither is mommy. I oh, know. Mommy's gone. She left us. Jake has figured out how to whistle. Show him. I can't, <laughs> no, I can't do it. The spotlight's on you, kid. Do it. <laughs> do it.